Hi students, I hope you're all doing great. So today I'm going to be talking to you about the life skills class and a little bit about what we're going to be doing. So you should have received or will be receiving a packet and a schedule that looks like this. And this video is going to cover some of the lessons from Monday, April 27th up until Friday, May 1st. And the first lesson I wanted to talk to you about is the lesson from Monday, April 27th, which is the My Values lesson. Um, I would like to let you know that you can do this lesson, just talk verbally with somebody in your household and they can sign off on it that you did it or you can do this by yourself and fill in the blanks or you can also record a video talking about this lesson and upload it to Classroom Dojo. Feel free to choose any of the three methods. So this lesson says from the list Circle three values that are very important to you. You may add your own on the lines at the bottom of the list, but ch still choose three. So I'm going to go ahead and read all the values to you. The first one says having good grades. The second one says having fun. Third is spending time with family. Fourth is having good friends. Fifth is honesty. Sixth is being a good athlete. Seventh is being creative. Eighth is being famous. Ninth is freedom. Tenth is helping others. Eleventh is being rich. And twelfth is being popular. If there's something on here that, or if there's something that's not on here, feel free to add it at the bottom. So for myself, and to give you an example, I chose the three most important values for me are having fun, spending time with my family, and honesty. So once you choose your three values, you're gonna move down to the bottom and you're gonna answer the questions. And the first question says, which value is most important to you? I hope you can see it, but you can follow along with your packet. This is the first question. And I chose spending time with my family. That is my um, value that is most important to me. The second question says, why is this value so important to you? Well, this value is important for me because I love my family and they are the, the closest people I have to me. So that's why spending time with my family is important to me. You may have something different and that's fine. Just tell us why it's important to you. Okay. The third question is, what value do you think your parents would choose as more, most important? What do you think your parents would choose? Um, it's just a thought. There's no right or wrong answer. Again. And I chose, I think my parents would choose honesty. Um, the last question says, what value do you think your closest friend would choose as most important? Um, I think my closest friend would choose being a good athlete. And the reason is um, because your friend, you, you, me, I usually play like sports with my friends and stuff. So they would want me to be a good athlete so we can win our games. Um, during this week, you're also going to be writing some prompts, like answering some questions. And again, I'm going to show you the schedule. You're going to have to answer these prompts on Wednesday, April 29th. And, oh, sorry, on Tuesday, April 28th. And on May 1st, which is a Friday. And in this packet, I included an area that looks like this where you can fill in and answer the prompts and they're labeled this says think thankful Tuesday so for example on Tuesday April 28th on a separate sheet of paper you're gonna answer the following prompt and I already showed you the designated area so there's gonna be a slot for each day that I ask you to answer a prompt and on Tuesday you should be answering the following prompt. Thankful Tuesday. What are you thankful for today? An example of this, for example, today I'm thankful that I am here creating a video for you guys to continue educating you. So you can write anything that you're thankful for. You can write 
that you're thankful for your family, for having a roof over your head, for having a meal, for talking to your friend, anything that you're thankful for, just write it in. And again, like I said, if you can't write it in, talk about it with your somebody in your household and just have them initial for that day or that slot. Or you can upload a video on Classroom Dojo. Another worksheet you're going to be working on this week is, tr is um, the True Friends Worksheet, which looks like this. True Friends. And it says, think about a good friend. Complete this sheet. If you want to, you can give the completed sheet to your friend. You don't have to, but you can share it with your friend. Again, there's no right or wrong answer because everybody has different friends and different thoughts. So the first um, question says, my friend likes me because, and I filled mine out like this. My friend likes me because I'm funny. The second one says, I like my friend because, well, I like my friend because she's nice. Um, the third one says, my friend's favorite thing to do is play soccer. What is your friend's favorite thing to do? Maybe your friend likes to read books. Maybe your friend likes to watch um, TV shows. Maybe your friend likes to cook. Maybe she likes to bake, he or she. So write whatever your friend likes to do. The next one is, my friend and I like to watch movies together. What do your, you and your friend like to do? Do you like to watch YouTube videos together? Do you like to crochet together? Do you like to walk um, your dogs together? Do you like to go on a run? What do you like to do? Um, the next question is, my friend admires me because... I said, because I'm honest, why does your friend admire you? Do you help your friend? Maybe your friend admires you because you're helpful or you're always there for them. So feel free to write anything that you believe your friend admires you for. The next one is, my friend is really great because she is always there for me. I wrote in, my friend is great because she's always there for me. Why is your friend great? The last one says, two things my friend and I have in common are... My friend and I, what we have in common is we both like pizza and we both love dogs. So what what do you and your friend share? Um, so yes, this is a lesson you will be working on this week. Like I said, you can discuss with a family member, uh, your mom, dad, a sister, a brother, an aunt, an uncle, a cousin. Just have them initial for you or you may do this by yourself and fill it out. Um... Another prompt that you will be answering this weekend is on Friday. And the prompt is feel good Friday. What makes you feel good about yourself? Think about it. What, what makes you feel good about yourself? For me, an example I can give you is one thing that makes me feel good about myself is that I help others when they need the help. For example, um, on... Wednesday of this week, my sister texted me and she said, hey, I have some math homework. I don't understand. Can you come over and help me? And I went over there and I taught her some math skills. I helped her out and that made me feel good about myself. So why do you feel good about yourself? Are you helping around the house? Are you, um, what are you doing? Why do you feel good about yourself? Uh, did you help somebody in need? Do you feel good about yourself because you're completing your schoolwork? something like that okay so again if you have any questions any concerns please feel free to reach out to myself or miss mejia through email classroom dojo and i hope everybody is staying safe